We're live. ESPN Wide World of Sports, the Disney Boys Soccer Showcase, presented by A.S. Roma. And at the half, Tampa Bay United is leading the Atlanta Fire 2-1. Tom James alongside former college All-American Eddie Rodriguez. And Eddie, uh, you know, we talked about the early game jitters a little bit in the first few minutes for both of these teams, but we saw a lot of talent on both sides on display. Yeah, I know that was obviously the first 10 minutes of this match from both teams, Tampa Bay United, as well as the Atlanta Fire. TBU went ahead with two great early goals, and then Atlanta pushed at the end, almost equalized right before the half, and that's what they need to do in the second half to get better on the scoreboard. Well, you said it. Tampa Bay took advantage of the right side of that field as we take you to the highlights, and the scoring started from the corner kick. Yeah, Michael Bacon climbs the ladder with a great cross by the captain, Andy Gonzalez. And how about this bomb right here? John Baumhart just cleans it. It's a great volley from about 30 out. It makes it 2-0 for Tampa Bay United. And then Atlanta with the penalty kick, and Jabera Obeid gets them on the board, and that was a goal they desperately needed at that point. That was about the 35th minute. They would have one more chance right at the 39th minute and this is how they did in the first half we talk about the time of possession tbu was in control of that most of the way they did have more shots and just more aggressiveness all the way around it yeah team. but that 58 percent pretty much tells the story how they were able to keep the ball they were able to choose when to win forward and of course the more chances you have percentage more likely you are to score but you know, they almost tied it up at the end. They need to, as you heard the coach, continue to go forward in the second half. Well, there's the TBU team with instruction from Ray Hales. They lead it at the half. 